hello everyone it's me a summary welcoming you to my new photoshop tutorials and hope that all are safe and stayed at home and you are maintaining all the precaution to prevent the covid 19 and all are safe hope that and let's start the tutorial if you are new in my channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notification today i'll show you the process of making this type of raw type image how to make this type of effects and i'll provide you that preset in my video description as well so I'm deleting this one this one is the image and let's analyze at first in this photo you are getting something spot in a face and leaves and uh, other portions and I have to reduce that things and then I will apply the preset so how to do that make a copy by pressing ctrl J or command J and then filter camera filter so camera filter is a plugin of the photoshop creative cloud version and if you are the user of the cs version you have to install it manually please check out my video description for the installation file so at first i will just uh, smooth the skin and uh, reduce the spots so how to remove that i won't add or i won't use any other plugins except the camera so here you are getting a spot uh, healing brush tool in this portion you have to make it heal check this one and then which portion do you want to remove suppose this portion you select once and you can move and you can select that things if you need you can change the brush size by pressing third bracket opening and closing so select this portion and you can move that things from here and this portion as well okay uh, you can make it bigger by pressing like this so this portion now uh, these as in I will keep just because of this one is uh, another part of the beauty and here this portion majority part I will remove this portion so here and this portion you can make this one smaller by pressing third bracket opening and closing and this portion as well you can take this portion and here you can select over here visualize spots and you will get the prominent spots from here you can remove all of them so you can do that by using these things so that's fine and we'll find out the visible spots which are bothering you this portion you have to choose the perfect uh, skin uh, this one is uh, making the clone system and uh, it's taking uh, like uh, here this portion you have to yeah that's fine and if you want to remove that that means it's taking the pixel from the, the non affected area and it's filling up here that's good and here is some spots okay that's fine i'm zooming it out and then i'll adjust the lights and other stuff from the face i'm just turning it off yeah that's fine and in this portion you're getting something so you have to make it zoom make the brush size bigger and now it's fine this portion as well now that is fine and here the brush tool which is the beauty brush tool and select once over here the anchor point will appear and the setting will be like that texture minus 35 and clarity minus 40 dehaze plus 24 and minus 11 for the uh, saturation and the whites plus 10 shadow minus 9 highlights minus 41 and uh, plus 18 for the contrast and you can follow all the steps like me and i'm making not too much smooth before and after let's see zoom it in before and after i'm just smoothing the rugged portion which is not good for a portrait photography not too much and if you need you can adjust the all the stuffs i just given you the settings here i just shown you and discuss over here and i won't remove the here from here just because of and uh, that is another part of the beauty in our rural indian girls so i'll remove that things okay 
making the brush size smaller or bigger by pressing third bracket opening and closing as usual I'll brush over here for this portion and this area as well another hand I'll remove that or brush over here so if you need you can increase the lights or other stuff place the anchor point over here increase that things the light will increase so this portion shadow and highlighting you have to maintain that things just because of it's the beauty of the photography portrait photography where is adding the shadow and uh, where the highlight going on it's totally up to you and it's important for you so our retouching our face retouching is done and now i'll go to the hand tool from here and then i'll apply that preset which i made it for you guys earlier so that is the name the urban type photo or urban type preset uh, here urban bd bd urban number four and load it up so after adding that you are getting something trouble over here and here i'll adjust the light a little bit yeah that's fine and then the highlight whites and highlights i'll make it like this so if you need you can change up the all the settings like that so these settings is good for me and let's see the settings what i have used over here so before one was like that and after one is like that so you can add the texture i'll add some texture like that and the, the whites i'll make it a little bit down and the highlight that's fine yeah that's good temperature minus one tint minus 41 just because of i want to make it like a uh, greenish tone that's why i made it like that next exposure 0 0.10 contrast plus 11 highlights minus 60 shadow zero if you need you can add the shadow and other stuffs i want to make it moody that's why i made it like a little bit like that and then blacks minus uh, plus 21 and texture plus 17 clarity plus one dehaze if you need you can make it dehaze like that it will give you so before one and after one so i need these things to make it moody and vibrance minus 36 just because of the mid tone mid tone i made it like that and the saturation minus five that's good the tone curve rgb tone curve i locked up over here and made it a little bit upper side for the grammar and it make your photographs moody and the red options here i just down over here just because of here is the lack of these histogram that's why i made it like that and the green i make like that and a little bit up over here and the blue portion is like that so input value 1 and output value 10 and in this portion detailing two portion sharpening and noise reduction sharpening uh, if you need you can increase the sharpening i didn't sharp too much just because of uh, the issue of the like smoothness and the noise reduction i made it 17 though here is no grain that's why i didn't increased it too much i made it 17 is good for me and the hsl hue saturation luminance what color will be the percentage of the color and intensity of the color so hue here is all the zero except the red plus three just because of making it a little bit uh, warm or orange type and the blue or aqua i made it minus three just because of making the dress color a little bit aqua and then saturation percentage of the color the red percentage 58 orange percentage 8 and yellow percentage minus 21 green plus 48 and the aqua blue plus 44 purple minus 8 and the magenta minus 28 and luminance that is the intensity of the color and i made the red luminance plus 53 orange plus 44 yellow plus 28 and the green plus 6 aqua 14 and rest of the thing is zero and then split toning most important thing the highlight tone and the shadow tone color that means two color are two things that you are splitting in two way and you are you can control all of them that means highlight color you can control with the hue and the saturation hue is the color which one you want to give in the highlight portion and that is the value 129 and the saturation portion you can control the percentage of that color and the shadow same process 
like uh, you are getting the color which one you want to in the shadow portion that is the value 222 and the saturation 13 that's good no lens correction issues over here and the effects i didn't add grain portion and from the post crop vignetting i added some like post crop vignetting minus 16 calibration or camera calibration here you can use the color grading here minus 47 for the red primary color that's why you are getting a little bit pink type if you make these things like that it will be more orange or yellowish you can control these things like here you can adjust your own photographs you can adjust you have that assumption when i will provide you that preset you can adjust all the settings and stuffs like your photography just because of in this photo you are not getting the proper light as like me so this photo credit goes to the joita friend here the green primary color minus 15 and uh, plus 52 green primary color minus 15 and uh, the blue primary color that is minus 52 and hit the ok button you are getting the you are getting the before and after before and after so you are getting nice effect which is the moody but urban type moody or indian uh, like environment so you can use that preset free of cost if you want to get the download link please check out my video description and lots of thanks to joy Afrin for providing this type of photo for making my presets and the other stuffs. thank you so much and thanks to all those who are watching my video and if you have any kind of question query request please do comment in my video comment section and check out my video detail for the download link of the camera raw filter and this preset has all will be safe and stay at home and you can you can overcome this pandemic situation hope that keep me in your prayers as well until the next video i am a7 signing out today bye bye